Hey guys, today I'm going to go ahead and read us the article from this week's homework. It is solids, liquids, and gases. Okay. All matter is made up of tiny particles called atoms, which combine to form new mixtures. Most matter on earth exists in one of three states or forms, solid, a liquid, or a gas. Water's three states of matter should sound familiar. They are ice in its solid form, water in its liquid form, and water vapor in its gas form. Which state a substance is in depends on how its atoms behave. Solids have a fixed volume and maintain their shape very easily, unless they are changed by force. A metal wire, for example, keeps its shape unless it is hammered or twisted. This is because the particles in a solid are rigidly bound together and are difficult to move. When you heat a solid, the links between the particles are loosened. Most solids melt into liquids. Liquids have no fixed shape. They spread out to fit the container they are in. Think of what happens to the shape of water when you use it to fill a glass. But a liquid's volume stays the same. Particles in a liquid remain in close contact, but move freely around one another. If a liquid gains energy, such as thermal energy, it will become a gas. A gas has neither a fixed volume nor a fixed shape. It expands to fill the space it is in. When you take a hot shower, water vapor begins to move and form near the shower. Eventually, the vapor spreads evenly throughout the room, fogging up mirrors and windows. This happens because gas particles do not cling to one another. They can spread around easily. Okay, so go ahead and address the questions that are in the homework this week, and I will see you in class.